Hey guys, what's up? I'm back with another video and today I'm doing Eyes to Horror Game. So we'll go straight to options and I've just loaded the sound so you can hear me and I've also done the difficulty to hard. Now I have been playing the game so I know what I'm doing and first of all we need to find 30 bags of money and get to the exit. That's basically the whole point of the game is to survive, get to the exit, etc, etc. So straight away we're just going to go to the mouse and just do that there. So, you click on things to open them, of course, and collect bags of money. So, we've got the basement key, and it says push the door to open. Also, we can use M for the map, if we had one. Um, I don't think you get one in the hard difficulty, so, I mean, you might, you might not. I don't think you do, though. So, we'll go in here, and there's another one. And we'll go straight back out. So I've been playing the game for a while, like I've been saying. And I found it really good. I mean, I'd rate the game, out of all the games i played that are horror games, I'd rate the one roughly a nine. Um, I don't think I'd rate it anymore, though, because it could be better. Uh, you can only pick one setting of the visual looks, so there's only one like look there's no better quality that you can get and um, I'm just getting chased at the moment I'm not going to turn around this that thing's really scary and <laughs> yeah it, it's just like the eyes what they do if you're wondering uh, they show you where the monster is so if I press Q now the monster's in the basement and uh, well I'm up here I can start to do a few stuff. No, just go into rooms, get back some money, do that, get that, sorry. And um, we got combination. No, the eyes are always in a different place as well as the. Oh my god, no. So the eyes are in a different place, like I was saying. And also. The bags of money are. I think there's always going to be one in the. Sorry about this. Oops. There, sorry about that. Uh, it's just my phone went off. I hate my phone so much. So, like I was saying, the bags of money are always in a different place. They're never in the same place. So, well, I think there's always going to be one in the safe. Uh, but aside from that, I don't think there is. So, like I said, they're, they're all over basically. And uh, I, I don't want to come near this monster thing. Oh my god! Oh god! Uh, <laughs> yeah, sorry about that, guys. Um, so we just play again and we <laughs> jump straight back into it. So, like saying. There's not always the bags of money, there's the key and money there, but that was just chance overall. So we'll go straight in here now, see what I mean, there's one there, and there's also one over here. So we press Q before going out, and it's in the basement still. You can still move when in this mode when you're looking at the monster thing, but you won't know basically where you're going unless you was looking at the door beforehand. So... We're just going to collect a few more bags of money. I don't think I went in here last time, so... I mean, the detail's pretty good already, but you'd want more. You know, I like looking at the scenery. I, I like to, you know, immerse myself in the game, etc, etc. So... Uh... Oh, uh, uh, thank God for that. Right, I'll go into the basement, I think. Oh. Uh. Um. Oh come on! <laughs> that was so scary just then. Uh, I mean, this monster is like the cookie monster or something. It just, it just wants to come after me, and I, I don't even know why. In the story, all it says is basically it wants you. Uh, I've completed it once on normal difficulty. Basically, what it says is, I've had a feeling that something's following me. Um, this 
the story of the game is basically your mate asks you to bring very bags of money and uh, you bring the money and he's like, I can't talk right now, this is at the end of the game, so he goes, I can't talk right now, I've, uh, I think someone's following me and then all you hear is him hit the keyboard, which is quite funny because it's like, it's quite real realistic, I guess. I'm not too sure, but I, I just found it quite funny. So, if we go downstairs into the cellar, 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 <laughs> bring it to me. Now, I, I hate being down here. So, I'll tell you all about the time that I got stuck in a morgue. Then, I got, I got, I got, uh, yes! Victory shall be mine! <laughs> no, so I'll tell you about the time I got stuck in a morgue. Basically, I was visiting my nana in hospital. And I didn't know the hurt time, but in hospitals, there's a service elevator for when they carry the dead people. Now, I was real eager to get home for some reason. And for some reason... Oh, come on! Oh, go away! Oh! So, anyways, I, I took this elevator, thinking, oh, uh, everyone else is an idiot who's taking, like, the normal elevators and that lot. I'll just take this one. And now, it, it didn't say ground floor, it didn't say G, it didn't say, like, half or whatever. It just said B, then it went 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and etc, etc. So I thought, well, if that's the case, uh, I'll just press B, no, thinking it's base floor. I mean, it, it, it could have been that, but I've, come on. So anyways, I thought it was um, base floor, and it took me to a mug, and boy, it was so scary. It was like, uh, it was like the scary thing you could ever see as like a little child. This, uh, I don't know how old I was, but I wasn't that old when I went there, and um, I was all by myself, and I was just stuck in the mug, and I, I was just wishing for the button to hurry up and be like taking me up but I was stuck down there for quite a while and all you could see was the big blue doors like you see in the movies then the um, behind the doors there was the like um, shutters where they put the dead bodies in and I was so scared I was, I was like I said I was only a little child come on no 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 Ugh. Right, <laughs> I'm sorry guys, I'm putting it to normal. I haven't done it on hard, but I have done it on normal. So yeah, I was just stood there, and the big doors were just, like, basically looking at me. And it, it was just one thing that you never want to see as a child. So, it, it, in future, I'm never going to the hospital elevators. I'm always taking the stairs now. It's just, uh, I, I don't actually know what happened. It's, I think Fap's messing up. So, let's collect this piece, uh, piece over here. Now, the reason I put on easy was, be, well, normal was because all you have to do is click, um, I think it's like 20 bags. So, that's pretty good. Now, I'll wait a few seconds, see where this thing's going. And it's coming straight this way. No, go away. No one likes you. You have no friends. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. It it probably has lots of friends, and it's and it's a beautiful little face. It's like a beautiful baby boy thing. Uh, I'm not sure if it's even a girl. It it we'll name it 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 the clown. <laughs> no, I'm gonna run for. In certain rooms, this thing, it, cannot get you. It's like, um, some rooms have, like, a barrier, I think. So, oh, God, Ugh, run straight into it, perfect idea. <laughs> no, I could, so I'm going to end it here, guys, but thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're new, it does help. Like and comment. If you want to see something new, just say in the comment section below, and I will get onto it, and... I hope you guys have the best day. See ya. Bye.